Welcome and welcome back to Scorpio Tiger's Tarot. I'm Scorpio Tiger. I'm here to do the weekend reading for the sign of Sagittarius. I hope everyone's had a wonderful week. We're getting right into this. This is a general reading, so take the resonates, leave the rest, and you already know what to do if love shows up, reverse roles as needed. Okay? Your overall energy, Sagittarius, is the chariot, the cancer energy. Moving forward, moving away. You're doing some kind of motion. <laughs> Sagittarius Collective. What's going on with Sagittarius Collective? This weekend of July 14, 2023, or whenever they are added to this video. Those that have subscribed, thank you. Those who like the videos and share the videos. Those that are divinely guided to this channel, welcome. What's going on with the Sagittarius? We've got the Queen of Wands. That attractive energy. Fruitful and abundant energy. What's going on with the Sagittarius? This weekend. We're under that Gemini moon all weekend until um, Sunday, Monday. We move into, we have that new moon in Cancer. Okay, so set your intentions. We got judgment, that uh, Scorpio energy, Queen of Wands, and Sagittarius. That's your energy also. Sagittarius is, is one of them. Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. Okay. I'm going to have to look, have to look that up. Sagittarius this weekend. You're making a move. You had a crossroads. About your business with the Page of Cups. Let's see. Okay. Okay, but it, it's over now. Whatever you've been going through, all this stress and worry, them sleepless nights and things. Yeah, it's over now. Okay. Queen of Wands. Why is this here for the Sagittarius Collector? Why is the Queen of Wands here? Queen of Wands. Why is this here? Okay, you got a new beginning coming in, okay? That Ace of Swords in reverse, that's a great, a force of great love and hate, okay? Okay, if there's going to be a new beginning and you're going to gain some clarity about something, okay? You're going to understand and know the truth, the power to cut things off and, 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 Cut people out. Cut things or people out. Okay? Mm hmm Somebody could be, um, somebody could be pregnant. Is that what it is? That's serious? Somebody's pregnant? That's what it looks like. Somebody's pregnant. Yeah. Getting blessed with this brand new, uh, bundle of joy, this abundance. Okay, this is going to start a whole new chapter though, because both of these cards are about new beginnings. Okay, yeah, Eight of Pentacles, putting that work in. There's somebody pregnant, you definitely been putting some work in. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm it's late. Judgment, why is judgment here? <laughs> why is judgment here? Somebody could be pregnant, or that's what it looks like, though. Somebody pregnant because it's clarifying that king, that queen of uh, wands. All right, we got the nine of cups clarifying the judgment. Okay, getting to your wish fulfillment. I just looked at that nine of cups earlier to see what else it meant. Let me see. Discontentment, wishes, satisfaction for the seeker. Okay, almost complete. Okay. Reflecting on how far you've come. That's what it is. Okay. And being selfish. Okay, but I think you're reflecting on how far you've come. And, and you're at a crossroads on deciding what you want to do next. That's what I'm... Yeah. 
you gain some information, some clarity. Let's bring a balance to you, okay? Taurus, Cancer energy. Page of Cups, yeah. Maybe you've been at a crossroads and now you're just reflecting on where you've been and where do you want to go. How do you want to handle this situation? The Page of Cups, okay? Why is the Page of Cups here? This card of business, luck, doing what's right for you with the Two of Wands. The Ten of Swords, why is this here? Yeah, doing what's, what's right for you because you're tired of being stressed out, having this internal conflict, and um, not sleeping well at night, Sagittarius. So you're deciding to do what's best for you right now. A message may be coming in that's going to help you do just that, to get you over this hump, or this crossroads that you're at. Ten of Swords. Why is this here? It's over now. The hard part is over, Taurus. I mean, Sagittarius. Might be dealing with Taurus. Sagittarius. The hard part is over. You can have Taurus in your chart also. You got 12 placements in your birth chart. Okay? Six of Swords. Okay? Yeah, the hard part is over. So now you're ready to move forward. Okay? Yeah, doing what's right for you, Sagittarius. Cutting off things that don't serve you and walking away from things that don't serve you. Good stuff. Having clear communication and walking away from whatever doesn't serve you. I, I need to go back. Forgive me. Let's go look at that Queen of Wands real quick. I want to see what else she, she means. Yeah. Can grow and encourage. She's she the same as the king. Very magnetic and stuff. Dark country woman. Okay. Friendly, loving, honorable. Busy, overload. Okay. If the car beside her is a man, she feels positive or sympathetic towards him. We don't have that. If a woman, she's interested in a seeker also. Love and money. Okay. Very attractive. Take care of yourself, your hairs and your nails, and goes to the gym and stuff. Okay? Very powerful and magnetic. Ideas and creativity. Willful and go-getter. Been through a lot in life. Okay, I'm sorry. That's not, that's not it. Care less what others think. Self-centered, self controlling, and hot-headed. Dependable and protective. Mm hmm and the cat is lucky. I really feel like somebody's pregnant and you're at a crossroads thinking about where you've been and like you don't really know what to do about this situation, but somebody's gonna give you a message that's gonna help you decide to, to do what's best for you. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing here. And the hard part is over, all them sleepless nights and all that stress you've been dealing with, that part is over with. And you're going to speak clearly about your wishes and what it is you want. And, and you're going to be successful with that, okay? So this is just about moving forward, Sagittarius. But it really looks like somebody is pregnant, is what I'm seeing, okay? And I'm surprised the pregnancy card did not come out. If someone is not pregnant, this could be saying that you found out some truth about something or someone that's going to bring you in some abundance, okay? And it's still the same. You know, you, 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 your stress that you've been going through is over. Let's get you some advice. What's going on? I mean, any advice for the Sagittarius Collective regarding the spread? Wow, okay, let's try that again. Because that just was doing the most. Okay, thank you, Spirit. Let's try that again. Sagittarius Collective, thank you. Get some more advice from Sagittarius Collective. Okay. Running. See, I was really not trying to say that because I saw that in this reading too. If somebody is running from something, reality could sometimes feel too hard to face. Like somebody got pregnant and somebody's trying to run. 
that's what I was seeing. I didn't want to say it. But yeah. I miss you. No communication, no contact. So somebody's pregnant and somebody's running. It's too late to apologize. You don't need an apology. The best closure is moving forward on your path. Okay? So somebody I got you pregnant or vice versa and took off. Because that's what I was seeing. I didn't want to say that. Because y'all know me. I don't really like negative stuff. Yeah. That's not cool. Any advice for the Sagittarius Collective here? This energy in this reading. And that's what it looks like. Just pathetic. They want to go bareback. They want to go bareback, but they don't want to deal with the responsibilities of it. That's terrible. You know the repercussions. You go bare bad. It's, it's a possibility somebody getting pregnant. It's a possibility y'all getting pregnant. It's a past life relationship. You have known each other uh, before. Okay? In a past life. Now here they come again. And this stuff going on. They going to run. Yeah. Think of a question, Sagittarius. I'm gonna pull the question and the answers deck. The angel answers deck. I thought I felt something. Something flip over. One more time. <clears throat> Excuse me. Any questions you may have, Sagittarius? Any answers for the Sagittarius collector of this energy in this reading? Within the next few weeks. Anything else? I'm a Sagittarius collection. Thank you. Within the next few months. Y'all know it's a whole bunch of people watching these videos. Last time around. This person is trying to run. What is it that Sagittarius needs to know? It could be you, Sagittarius. I don't know. But the person that's trying to run from this situation, what's going on with them? That may not be known. Thank you. Thank you. Stop being paranoid and projecting your insecurities. Please just hear me out. Closet races or prejudice. Somebody that got somebody pregnant outside they race. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Any advice? For the Sagittarius Collective regarding the spirit from the African Goddess Rising Dead. Any advice? Thank you. Speak up was upside down. We flip that over. One more time. honest all right about how you're feeling about the whole situation that you're going through be be open and honest about that and yes exactly speak your truth we're adults at least we're supposed to be speak your truth and radical rebirth okay you're going through a transformation right now all right so it is what it is go with the flow of things you know if, and, if, and if somebody is pregnant out there, let me tell you something. We only here to procreate. We ain't here for nothing else. I don't know why people keep on talking about, like, um, 
you know, you got to have the best cars, the nicest houses, the best clothes and stuff. That stuff don't mean nothing. You're here to make kids. That's what we were created to do, was procreate. You got a baby, have that baby. The most high take care of you, no matter what. You hear me? You're, you're, gonna, you're not going to want for a thing. You know why? Because you're going to be blessed for bringing that baby into the world. Most high don't give you no more than, no more than you can handle, Sagittarius. All right, you mark my words, you're gonna be just fine. Okay, thank you so much for coming to Scorpio Tigers Tarot. And like I always say, say it with me, make it a great weekend on purpose. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.